I am now pleased to introduce Francis O'Leary, who was selected as today's student responder in recognition of her undergraduate research and campus involvement. Francis. Francis is receiving a Bachelor of Science in Computer Science and Mathematics. After graduation, she plans to work as a flight software engineer on the Dragon capsule at SpaceX. Please welcome Francis O'Leary. President Chang, the Board of Trustees, faculty, staff, family, and friends, thank you for the role you've played in helping us to be here today. My focus for this speech is the past, present, and future, because today marks an important inflection point in all of our lives. Everything you've done up until this point shaped who you are today, and what you do right now will ultimately shape your future tomorrow. My past begins with my late maternal grandparents both teaching at Purdue after emigrating from China following World War II, and in every way Purdue helped them to realize their American dream. It is so special to me to be able to walk the same campus they did over 60 years ago. I dedicate this speech to them and so many others who passed before our day came, because I know that if love were enough, they would be in the audience celebrating with us today. My mother earned a degree in chemistry from Purdue and subsequently a master's in biochemistry. She then realized something. Scientists like her could create life-saving medicines, but systemic barriers could still prevent access. This prompted her to return to school to get a master's and doctorate, this time in public health. The lesson I learned from her path is that we must always remember the big picture. As certified stewards of the sciences, it is our responsibility to remember the human side. The results of our research and creations will impact people we will never meet, and we must think of the implications that run parallel with our work. Your words and ideas can and will change the world. Make sure it is in service of a net good. People like to say that today is a gift because it is the present. Well, my present to you all is the last assignment of your undergraduate career. Thank someone who helped you get you where you are today. Contemplate all the thank yous you have already given. Who did you miss? Use this as an opportunity to make someone smile and brighten their day. I have learned to never discount the impact that simple kindness can have on a person. I have the joy of doing this now. Thank you to Alyssa Honigford, Celia Brazel, and Alessandra Sacchetti for reminding me that you can work hard and have fun too. Finally, the scariest of them all, the future. After today, we will all scatter across the world. This in itself can be foreboding. New opportunities, new places, and new faces. It is natural to be a little nervous, and when the fear of the unknown comes barreling at you like a runaway train, have the grit to recognize that it's just the Boilermaker special waking you up once again on a game day morning. <laughs> grit allows us to recognize that this fear is actually a friend. It's an opportunity to change the world. Now this is the same world that, it, that will convince you it is evil if you let it. But there's good news. A lot of the challenges we face like ethical AI, climate, ch climate change, and cancer are all ones that we may tackle as Purdue alumni with our newfound degrees. As we all move on to our next giant leaps, please remember how it felt to be in high school watching the news and wondering, well, why can't we just fix that? What is so hard about it? Some problems will now seem impossible given how much you know about them. But conquering them starts with one simple question. What would it take to fix it? As said in the case for space, people will do anything to survive, even become better. Here's to the futures we shape as new graduates. Congratulations to the class of 2023, and when you're all famous and running the world, remember, just because you're in the driver's seat doesn't mean you need to run people over. <laughs> be curious, be gracious, and above all else, be kind. You never know who needs it. Boiler up, hammer down, and hail Purdue. <laughs>